Hi all, in this video I am going to show you guys a tutorial to use tracker node to stabilize video in DaVinci Resolve Fusion. So if you are wondering why use this method that is use this tracker node to stabilize the video. The simple reason I can share is that it will give you guys complete control over stabilizing the video. You can track the point that will be used to stabilize the video by using this tracker node. So you will get a complete control on the stabilization that you are doing on the video. So let's jump into this video. So first add tracker node to your composition. Then do the tracking. If you are new to the tracker node, you can watch the video linked in the comment to get a complete walkthrough to use the tracker node. Thing to note is that you should have at least two track points to stabilize the video. Also another thing that you want to make sure about this point is that make sure that there is no big perspective difference between these two track points because if there is big perspective difference between these points then our stabilization will not be good. And another thing is that after tracking and stabilizing the video we can still use the offset option in the tracker to offset the track points to get better stabilization. So after tracking head over to operation tab choose match move from merge change it to BG only. Then by using the position rotation scaling tick boxes we can stabilize these motions. And from the match move settings from pivot type we can adjust the pivot point used for rotation. Tracker average will use the average point from the two trackers. Selected tracker will allow you to choose one of the tracker that you added. And in manual we can manually adjust the x and y value. We can use this pivot type option to get better stabilization on the rotation motion. Next on to the reference option. On reference option we can set a frame. That frame will be the final stabilized frame that we want to achieve. So the tracker will try to achieve the same frame as the frame we set in the reference option for stabilization. Start means it will be the starting frame and means it will be the ending frame. By using select time we can set custom frame. For that first select the frame then choose select time option from this reference option. So that's all about this video guys. I hope you guys find this video useful. If you do so hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.